I've been thinking about the runes Kazador carved into my back. I don't know much about Infernal, but I know anything written in Devil Script is going to be bad news. I'm afraid that through those ruins, somehow, Kazador might still be able to dominate me. Find an expert, of course. And I already have one in mind. Our devilish friend, Raphael. If anyone's going to know about Infernal Text, he will. Well, we won't know until we ask now, will we? Uh, unfortunately, he comes and goes on his own schedule, so we'll just have to look out for any sulfurous odors or the sound of questionable poetry. Meanwhile, I think I'll spend some time studying the art of infernal negotiations. now a bosom companion. Take care that thou art not distracted on thy quest, seeking the comforts of the flesh. Recall that in time, all becomes dust and bone. Hello, my sweet. It's not a plan yet. More a feeling. Just an itch at the back of my mind. But I know I'm missing something. Whatever Casador did to me, it was more than his usual sadism. It had purpose. Once I know what that purpose was, maybe a plan will present itself. But for now, I just need to scratch this itch. What am I to do? 
looking ahead. Ah, my quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you. Greetings. Huh. So that's what people mean when they talk about butterflies in their stomach. Did you want something? Difficult to say. A fellow servant of the Night Singer would surely be an ally to me under most circumstances. But something doesn't add up. I'll need to see where his allegiances truly lie. The voice of the Absolute is strong here, and getting stronger. I don't know how much longer I can resist it. But it's good to see you're making progress. It's a good thing you decided to infiltrate the cultists rather than fight them. The Absolute has already mustered an impressive army, and its forces still grow. Does what happened in the Grove bother you? Better enjoyment than regret. For what it's worth, you made the right choice. If we don't accomplish our goals, none of this matters. Not their fate, not anyone's. The hurt runs deeper than she's willing to show you. Yes. Yes, I am. It just doesn't stop. We are being bombarded by waves of telepathic energy. Wave after wave, with hardly a breath between them. I almost dare not rest. Each wave a set of orders to the infected. The order for your transformation has been given many times already. Yes. But the orders are oddly erratic, as if the Absolute cannot make up its mind. I don't fully understand. In any case, the Absolute knows you carry me with you now. It wants to retrieve me. I know. I'm glad you are on my side. I am the only one who can resist the Absolute's influence. Hence its fear of me. It's... It's desperation. Unfortunately, that also means it is dedicating more and more resources... ...to my retrieval. The task ahead is monumental. But you've proven that you have the resolve to do what must be done. You've shown your loyalty to the Absolute. But to gain an audience with it, you must prove yourself to Catherick Thorn. Now I must rest. And you must carry on. Do not let my efforts be in vain.
was hoping you'd come to chat. What do you... Greeting. Hello, my sweet.